Here's one for you. What gets bigger, better, and is guaranteed to put a smile on my face every single day? <laughs> the Art Attack Gallery. It's filled with your Art Attacks. How about this fantastic tribal mask from Bethany? I love the cut-out feather shapes all around the outside and the simple patterns on the face. Brilliant. And look at this great use of wax resist from George. I really like the way you've given each drawing a different block of colour to highlight it. And look at this Egyptian-style necklace from Michael. Just by threading dry pasta onto string and painting each piece individually, you've made a really nice piece of jewellery. Yeah, great piece of homemade jewellery there from Michael. Do you know what? It's inspired me to make some jewellery, but this is a piece of jewellery with a difference, because you can break bits off it to give to your best friends. Now, first you're going to need to find an old jigsaw, one that's got bits missing that you don't want anymore, and take a few pieces out of the middle that still fit together like this. Now, believe it or not, we're going to turn this old jigsaw into some beautiful jewellery. Give your jigsaw pieces a base coat of white paint like this. Then making sure that you keep all the pieces together, start to design the pattern for your jigsaw jewellery. Make sure that the pattern goes all over the pieces. How about a splat design? And you can make them different sizes, large and small. And when you've finished drawing all of your splats and you're happy with your design, just paint it. And again, make sure you keep all the pieces together. How's about a red splat to start with? And then maybe a bright yellow one. And this jewellery is going to have a blue background. Just keep painting your jewellery with nice bold colours so that each piece will really stand out. When you finish your design and it's dry, take out one of the pieces from the jigsaw and there is your piece of jewellery. Because watch this, if you tape a pin on the back like that, just one of these safety pins, it makes a really cool badge. And the great thing is, if you put a pin on the other pieces of jewellery and give them to your best friends, not only do they look cool, but it's a sort of membership badge for all the guys in your gang. Because when you all come back together, all the badges will interlock again and the pattern will join up. Of course, other people, uh, not in your gang, might try to make one, but it won't fit into the original jigsaw. It's a fake. Fake jewellery, not in the gang. <laughs> And there's lots of different patterns you can create for your jigsaw jewellery badge. How about a piece of jigsaw jewellery made from a camouflage pattern? Or the flicky paint pattern? Or even a spider's web design? Try it yourself. Be one of the gang with a jigsaw jewellery badge.